Let's talk about resonance on the chlorate ion, ClO3-. So if you count up the valence electrons and you draw a Lewis structure, this is what you end up with. And this is the best or most likely Lewis structure for ClO3-. The formal charges on each atom, they're zero except for the single bonded oxygen. That'll have a negative one formal charge. And that makes sense because the ion is one minus. So those need to match. Chlorine does have an expanded octet, but that's okay because chlorine can have more than eight valence electrons. There are two other major ways we can draw the Lewis structure for the chloride ion. Instead of having a single bond here, we could kind of shift it around. So let's take and move the single bond instead of here, over here. We can move these in, that forms the double bond, and then move these over here. Now this oxygen has the single bond. Likewise, we could take and move the single bond down here. We could move these out here. So now this oxygen has the single bond. And then we could just move these back. So those are three different ways. And really all we're doing is moving the single bond around in our Lewis structure. Those are called equivalent resonance structures. And we could draw it out to look like this. So these are our three major equivalent resonance structures. We have a single bond here. It's in the middle on this one on the left here. The arrows, they don't mean that these are switching back and forth. What they mean is that we have these three resonance structures and the actual structure, that would be an average of these structures here. Note that I've not drawn lone pairs on each of the oxygen and I don't have the brackets in here, but this is a good way to represent these resonance structures for ClO3 minus. And again, there really aren't three separate structures in reality. The actual structure, that's an average of these three but that's one of the limitations of Lewis structures. It's hard to show that. So we often use resonance to make that clear. This is Dr. V with the resonance structures for ClO3 minus the chlorate ion. Thanks for watching.